What's going on everyone, it's Zcash here and guys today I want to talk about the Dragon Ball Super card game because if you notice the Dragon Ball Super card game is starting to die out realistically speaking and the reason why I'm thinking is because of the One Piece card game. Everyone is just trying to focus on the One Piece card game so much right now that the Super card game is just getting left behind because I believe most of the people that are playing the super card game are jumping on to the one piece card game even if you look at products for Dragon Ball Super like they're not really going for that much like I actually recently ended up buying a ultimate squad booster box for I believe 50 Canadian dollars and I believe in USD that's about 30 to 40 American dollars so like man like that's the cheapest booster box I've seen. I ended up grabbing it because I think it was a really good deal. And on top of that, if you look at like some of the latest set, like especially this this latest set that's going to have a guard rare in it, it's actually going lower than MSRP's price right now for the pre-orders. So like I don't know, man. Super, I believe it's starting to die out, and like products are just sitting there, man. For super, if you look at One Piece now, the One Piece card game, holy shit, most of the products. For Romans Dawn are already sold out, singles are sold out, OPO2 is already sold out, some places do have a pre-order, but they're doing it for so expensive right now, and even OPO3 right now, some places have already raised the price for that too. So yeah man, like I feel like One Piece is the reason why Dragon Ball Super is dying out, and it's getting to a point where like shit man, like they have to do something about it, because as you guys noticed, the Dragon Ball Super card game is making a mobile game. But I feel like that still won't be enough to bring back Dragon Ball Super. I feel like what they have to do right now is hope for the anime to come back. I feel like once they announce that Dragon Ball Super anime is coming back, I feel like that will bring at least the hype for the Dragon Ball Super card game to go up. Because then the anime will be there, people will be excited to play the game. And I know the next Dragon Ball Super arc that will be in the anime will be a nice, amazing arc. So that will bring... The fan base back up for Dragon Ball Super for competitive wise and for collecting wise. So that's why I feel like at this point they need the anime to come back. That's the only way the Dragon Ball Super card game will end up surviving because I don't feel like the Dragon Ball Super card game, like the mobile game version, I don't feel like that's going to help the game. Yes, maybe a little bit, but like at this point, I feel like the One Piece TCG right now is just it's on a different level right now. It's killing it, man. Roman's Dawn booster boxes are sold out. The pre-orders for starter decks, they're sold out right now too. And even the starter decks that came out, the starter deck 1, 2, 3, and 4. Man, those are freaking hard to get. They're going for overpriced right now. And the tournaments too, man. I went to a bunch of One Piece tournaments, like the local store tournaments. Man, they're always freaking packed. So like, I don't know. I just feel like at this point, the Dragon Ball Super card game has to do something. Like, it's dying out, realistically speaking. And One Piece is just taking over. So I don't know. Let's see what they could do about it. But anyways, what do you guys think? Do you guys think... The Dragon Ball Super card game is in trouble. Do you guys think the anime needs to come back for in order to bring back the Dragon Ball Super fan base back up again? Also, if you guys think that the Dragon Ball Super card game isn't dying out, then let me know in the comments below. Give me your reasons why you think this game's not dying out and it's doing well. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video and want me to upload more Dragon Ball Super and One Piece TCG content, then remember to hit that subscribe button and click that notification button so you're notified whenever I drop a new video. And also leave a like on this video. I appreciate it a lot. Anyways, it's been your boy Zcash, and I'll see you guys later.